happening guys? Welcome in, I really hope you're all well. Thank you for checking out this video. Today, I'm just gonna be showing you that groove that I just played in the intro and breaking down what's going on. So there's a PDF below, please do grab it. It's gonna make this way easier for you. What we're doing is we're, I'm gonna combining two concepts here really. The first one is a total like steal from Benny Greb. Um, I've seen him do this before. Basically just you're taking eighth notes and eighth notes are one and two and three and four and and we're taking that and splitting it between the right hand on the right cymbal and the right hand comes down onto the snare drum ghosted on the and. Sounds like this. It's a really cool little groove. It's got a really nice feel to play. It just feels great to play. What we're going to do is I'm going to fill in the left hand with some ghost notes and that gets a little bit busy because I'm going to put every E and A as a, as a ghost note. That means I'm also going to play beat two and four as a ghost note. So that means that I'm going to be going one E and a uh, two E and a uh. It's a bit of a challenge, but it's a great workout. So that bit, that's the first bit that we do. So that's the first eight notes of this groove, as you saw in the PDF below. That sounds like this. On the last note, by the way, we're going to put a bass drum. Sounds like this. In beat three and four, we're gonna keep that guy going. We're gonna get some ghost notes in there. And what I've done is I've just played three E and, that's three E and, ah on the bass drum, but also the and on the bass drum. So you get a kind of a, an overlapping kind of vibe. So it's less. From there, that's gonna give me a little gap to hit the back beat. And from there, this is the cool part, I'm gonna do a 30 second note little left foot left hand thing on the A uh, of four. So that sounds like this. And a uh, one, or in this case, a uh, a uh, one, four E and a uh, one, four E and a. Uh. Sounds cool. It's a lot easier if you just follow the PDF and I play it along for you. So let's try the whole thing nice and slow and see what it sounds like. Try that a little bit fast, maybe about 90 beats a minute. It's gonna start really cooking, gonna start sounding really cool. Let's try it. If you did like this lesson, which I'm sure you did, hit subscribe, give me a thumbs up, it really does help. Leave a comment below, tell me what you've dug about the lesson if you're liking the new format, and I will see you next week.